hello guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl star flames in this video we're gonna talk about Corey gamble why is it that chris jenner is refusing to get married to this man and who is Corey gamble really because we really don't know anything about him besides you know the title that he's been given as a business executive a talent manager who works with a few artists in the industry and he's from atlanta um it is said that he attended morehouse college where he studied business and marketing he has since then built his fortune to a net worth of roughly three million dollars we know that he now resides you know with chris jenner based on my understanding and chris jenner has been refusing to marry this man many people cannot understand why is it that chris jenner doesn't want to marry corey gamble now at one point chris kids were asking her if she secretly got married to court to corey chris is saying no right but I believe that, you know, Kris Jenner has some, inse some insecurity issues because she's a lot older now. And if you know about Kris Jenner back in the days, according to those reports, Kris Jenner was the type of girl that used to be up and about from this guy to this guy, cheating on her husband, all of that allegedly, right? And I believe that she saw herself you know, growing old and gray, dying with Bruce Jenner. And the moment that Bruce Jenner transitioned, it broke her heart. I believe that she was broken. But it's also giving the sense that Chris Jenner, you know, wasn't deeply in love with them, with that man. But because they were of a particular age, she decided that she was going to keep the relationship and work on it despite you know not because it really wasn't given deep love but i could be wrong now a current report published by the globe which suggests that chris jenner and corey gamble has not yet married irrespective of the fact that they have been in a relationship for almost eight years now Chris Jenner is worth a whopping $170 million, you know, estimatedly, okay? We know that her money comes from, you know, being the manager for her kids. She gets 10% of everything that they do, plus the family reality TV series. Also, Chris Jenner speaks at a few events, etc. So she gets a few dollars here and there, right? Now... I don't know what's going on with Chris Jenner and Corey Gamble's relationship because it's given the sense that there might be some infidelity coming from Corey. And as such, Chris Jenner, you know, wants to safeguard her heart, not wanting to take that leap. And also, she may want to secure her empire. I believe that she believes, you know, Corey has the certain i'm gonna say qualities to potentially manipulate her in case to potentially manipulate her if they get married and i believe that she's scared of that because when you look at chris jenner her history of marriage she normally marries the guy that is a lot wealthier than her so with her and corey gamble I believe it's safe to say it is the first time we're seeing Chris Jenner dating down. And because she's dating down, she's dating someone that is not on the same financial status as her. It brings about some amount of insecurity. But in all honesty, I could be wrong about this couple. We also know that Corey gamble is a lot younger there have been so many questions about corey being faithful to chris but whatever it is it really does not dismiss the fact that the relationship is really very much questionable chris jenner we believe 
loves to get married is it that she's holding on to Corey Gamble until, you know, someone her age group comes along that is of great wealth and, you know, status. Then she says, okay, Corey, that's it. I'm going to have to go because there's someone out there with a better opportunity for me because she could have gotten a prenup to protect her money, her assets, and her girl. So it's still raising the question of, does Chris Jenner truly trust this man? It's really given the sense that, you know, she doesn't trust him. But guys, I want to hear from you. Let me know what your thoughts are. And while you're at it, give this video a big thumbs up. See you all next time. Bye, guys.